Hey guys, um, I'm just uh, doing a little bit of a bonus training right now. And uh, I wanted you to see just how easy it is um, to set up uh, voicemails. So one of the things that we're actually doing live right now is uh, we've got uh, 180 leads that came in through uh, a lead magnet and um, they have left us their emails, stuff like that. And so what we're doing is um, we're gonna send out a, an email, we're gonna send out a text message and we're gonna send out a voicemail. And so um, I just wanna show you how easy it is to actually record a, uh, a voicemail. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pop onto my phone real quick and, uh, and just show you guys real quick. So there you go. All right, so <clears throat> it's real simple. All you've gotta do is just literally go into, if you have an iPhone, um, so the iPhone's real simple, is you can just go under and type in like voice memo and click on voice memo. And so we're gonna do this, be like, um, <clears throat> Hey, it's Aaron from Webly. Um, I just want to reach out real quickly. Um, you uh, grabbed one of our uh, free, um, you know, guides, and um, I just want to um, see if we could jump on a quick call. Um, you can give me a call back at 401-357-0700. Uh, I'm also just going to shoot you a quick text, um, so you can have a link there. And if if now's not a good time, I'll I'll put a little like a, a booking link for you. Uh, thanks so much. I appreciate it. Bye. All right, <clears throat> and so that's it. Like literally, I have. Um, you know, this, this file, right? So literally all I have to do here now um, is just uh, shoot that. So there we go. Boom. Edit. There was uh, Eaton 226. And uh, I'm just going to click that button. So see what I did. You guys can't really see what I'm doing here, but um, what I did is I clicked the three dots. So there's three dots on my screen and all I'm going to do is uh, share. And then uh, I'm just gonna do my airdrop for myself. Again, if you guys, uh, it takes a second for it to pick up on my, uh, my computer, come on. Come on, airdrop. Even if not, then we'll just do it the, the old fashioned way. And you can literally just send it to yourself through an email. <clears throat> Boom. Okay. So I just got my, uh, my email. We'll stop sharing that screen real quick. And I will grab that, that file. Okay. And let me just go like this so you guys can follow along. And so literally it just, it sends you this file. Now see how it says M4A. It's, it's in the wrong um, it's in the wrong file format, but that, that's fine. Watch, watch what's going to happen. So we're just going to download this um, N4A, have that, and then all you got to do is just um, uh, M4A to uh, MP3 or WAV. Zamzar. Zamzar is one of the best, real easy. And you just literally just drag it in like that. Okay. And there you go. There's my file. Um, this is going to be for the uh, Webinly. I just saw I have it named Webinly, and this was, um, you know, reaching out. All right. So inside of here, um, this was, um, you know, we say cold outreach, but it really is not cold. Um, this is people who opted into our free lead magnets and everything. And uh, obviously we're going to come in here, you know, we'll, we'll fire out um, the email. So this would be, um, you know, the subject line. I'll let you come back in here a little bit later and you can change out the subject line. Let me just save that. Uh, the next thing is going to be obviously this voicemail. So I'm going to shoot down that voicemail and we'll literally click here and I will just head over here and MP3. There it is. And there's my, my voicemail. Hey, it's Aaron from Webinly. Um, I just want to reach out real quickly. Um, you uh, grabbed one of our uh, free, um, you know, guides. And um, I just want to um, see if we could jump on a quick call. So literally, so that's it. So I literally, I send them a, a voicemail. It's a ringless voicemail, so it's not going to actually ring their phone. And you know how many people that, they don't just delete voicemails. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like they don't just delete it. So obviously the next point after this is we want to go ahead and follow up with the text message. So in the text message, um, 
you know, assuming that we have, you know, um, their first name. So, you know, hey, hey, Bill, um, it's uh, Aaron from Webinly. Uh, you know, you know, and, and type like people type, you know what I mean? Like people during text messages, you know how they type. So just left you a voicemail, voicemail. Um, uh, uh, grab uh, time convenient for you. Venient. Did I spell that right? I'm very bad at spelling for some reason. All right, there we go. Venient. I'm going to just go to put, even though I have it convenient for you. And then what you want to do is you want to put in your um, your link. Now, you wouldn't have anything saved in here just yet, so that's not a problem. Um, just hit save, make sure you have it. You can go and grab your, you know, settings, head over to your calendars, and then, you know, whichever calendar you're going to have. So, you know, for me, I would have mine. Uh, this would be mine right here. This is that link right here. And so I'm just grabbing that link and I can pop back into that campaign, which was, this is called the code lead outreach. And I'll literally just come back into that SMM message and just drop it just like that. Okay. Um, these trigger links, what they allow you to do is literally to save stuff. So if I wanted to utilize trigger links, I can come over here and I could do um, Aaron's um, calendar. Main, I'm just going to put main calendar. So I have that, that's Aaron's main calendar. You pop your link in there. And so think about this as like Bitly, okay? Think about this like Bitly. It's gonna literally like track your links and see if they can actually do it. Does that make sense to you? Um, and so for everybody, just hopefully that makes sense to you. <clears throat> what it also does, it allows you to actually set off triggers. So there's actually a super powerful things that can happen inside of here. So um, there's our cold reach out campaign. There's that little link. And if I wanted to, like I said, I could come over here and use the trigger link, Aaron's calendar. So that would be a trigger link. Um, I'm going to substitute it. I just want you to know that you can use either or. So if you're just brandy new and you don't really understand it all, then just, just do it this way first. Okay. But later on, you're going to see that you can actually set off other actions based upon if they're clicking this link or not. So um, I'm going to leave it because I would consider myself a little bit more advanced. Um, and so, boom, that's it. So there it is. Hey, it's Aaron. And I spelled my name wrong. That's great. This is a really good thing for people to really like look at, you know, so it's Aaron. I really just left you a voicemail. Grab a time. Um, here's that. Here's that link. Um, just left you a voicemail. <clears throat> So this is stuff that you'll have to test out yourself. Um, as you can already see like this, I would definitely leave a space, but you're definitely gonna have to like test this stuff out. Um, whether or not like that's gonna work or you have to actually say more, um, you know, that link. Um, this is where marketing comes involved. And so obviously you just send a voicemail, you know, I would, I would give it the appropriate time um, I'm going to go ahead and, you know, send you uh, uh, a text message. And so, you know, give it a five minute delay and then bang, you know, you sent the voicemail, you know, even if you want to put it like 10 minutes, it gives it that delay. Your email, the email doesn't really matter. Um, you know, maybe just give it a couple of minutes, but you know, you're firing off the email, then you're firing off the voicemail. And then literally you said in your voicemail that, you know, you're going to send them a text message with it. I think I said it or did I say I already sent it? Hold on a second. I don't remember. Hey, it's Aaron from Webinly. Um, I just wanted to reach out real quickly. Um, you uh, grabbed one of our uh, free, um, you know, guides. And um, I just want to um, see if we could jump on a quick call. Um, you can give me a call back at 401-357-0700. Uh, I'm also just going to shoot you a quick text. Yeah, so I'm going to shoot you a quick text. So I did say that. And so I literally, I do it 10 minutes and there it is later, you know, just in case, you know, they're most likely, just so you know, they're going to see the text first. So just keep that in mind about I'm um, shooting random messages. Um, I don't want to get into this at, during this little moment, but literally um, you can literally come in here 
and be like, hey, just left you a voicemail. Um, if you need that link, um, just, you know, let me know, you know, but I'm talking to like people. So just, just let me know here. Um, I'll, I'll send it right over, right over. If just, if you need that link to my calendar. Okay. And I'm going to get, I'm going to get real granular now. I'm ready. So this is all for the super overachievers, the overachievers. Okay. The overachievers. So stick by, watch out, because this is going to get complex. I wouldn't do this just to get started. I would wait till you guys know what you're doing and you've used the software before, but literally that's what's going to go on here. And all I'm going to do is now is I'm going to go super. So this is going to be ad trigger. This is going to be responded to cold um, SMS um, outreach. This is where it starts to get sophisticated, where these people think you're literally actually responding to them. Like they're going to think it's you. And so what happens? Okay. So inside of here, this is all this crazy shit can happen. And so customer replied. Okay. So if a customer replies where, so if a customer replies, um, you know, in a channel, um, replied to a campaign, um, all this crazy shit, which again, folks learning the software, um, take it in bits and pieces because you're going to learn how really powerful it is. Okay. So they replied to campaign, which campaign, um, that campaign that we were screwing around with, which is cold reach outreach. Right. So they replied to the cold reach outreach and, um, you know, they, they replied where, right. They replied where, like, you could say like, Oh, text me back. Yes. Or text me back money. Text me back to all this. Different stuff. You can do all this crazy stuff but I, I wouldn't get too, too fancy with it right now. All I want them to do is if anybody replies back to that SMS message, that's it. If anybody replies back, what am I going to do? Then I'm just going to go ahead and um, shoot them a message. Okay. So um, there's a couple of different ways that you can go about it. So you can literally just like bang, like send SMS message. Um, there's also these like custom variables that you can actually do the user um, their, their phone. So there's like a custom user that like you could go put their custom phone in there. And then inside of here, you could be like, um, yeah, uh, here is that link and boom. Um, underneath here we have, um, where's my calendar. So this is my contact calendar. Uh, oops. Let me just go grab my link. And again, this stuff, I'm just trying to show you that like this can get super, super sophisticated and very powerful. And the thing about it is there's always multiple ways to achieve things too. So just so that you know, but this is just like kind of a, uh, a little bit of a, a fun little uh, ninja hack uh, for everybody um, to get you super excited about this really powerful software.